Calls it her love letter to the Gulf Coast. In today's In Their Shoes, we meet a Coast native with a YouTube channel highlighting fun things to do here. Now, it's not her day job, it's her fun job. She says she does it for the viewers and to give them tips and courage, and sometimes it's that camera and the viewers that end up encouraging her. Hey, y'all, guess where we are today? We're over here in Biloxi at the Point Cadet Marina about to go parasailing. I've never done this before in my whole life. I have no idea what I'm getting into, but the lady of the hour, she's the one who's making me do it. This is your Gulf Coast gal. This is Nicole Martz. Hi. Nicole, welcome Good to the morning. show. Thank you so much for having me. I am so excited to take you along for this adventure. Before we get started, though, I've got a few things. I have my own intro to do. Is that okay? Uh, sure. Okay, and then here you go to be, you know, a Gulf Coast gal on your own, the official eyewear. <laughs> hey y'all, Nicole here, your Gulf Coast gal, and I am so excited to go parasailing. Have you parasailed? I have, but it's been quite some time, maybe when I was a little taught. There's no bench. No. I thought there was going to be a bench, I did Nicole. Too. I did too. You maybe, are not my gal pal at this point. <laughs> maybe they'll build one. I have faith. Okay. You know, it's funny. You think of me as like Mrs. Adventure. I do. Not wet. You're like down for anything. I well, I, I think I am too <laughs> until you, you you test it. Do you need me to do it for you? So we're like in this group. We, we have are. a whole we have a whole this group of people. Like, it's a party crew for it sure. It is. And then like we all I guess get to rock paper scissors like who goes first, yeah. who goes second, who goes third. Someone could volunteer as tribute. I don't know if we're going to be brave enough to do that. And we're all Yay! Yay! Oh my god. You want to go first? Why not? Why not? Uh, Mike is talking us into it. Taking uh, one for the team. Yeah, let's go first. Okay, we're about to take off. We're we're filming. This is you. This is all you. What do we hold on to? Um what do we what do we figure it out? We'll figure it out. Oh my god. How long are we gonna be in the air? Uh, seven minutes. Seven, seven minutes. minutes. Oh my god. Oh. oh. And the wind oh. is uh moving? Yes. Oh <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> I'm over here like pulling on the hook and I'm like, Jamie, don't pull on the hook. How high do you think we are now? Like hundred feet? Um yeah, I don't think we're three fifty yet. No. He says like the oh, oh. Like the yeah, like the Bower Bog. Where is the Bower It's way behind us. I don't know if y'all can see it. Not that high. Oh Ooh, not my that gosh. High. Oh my gosh. Okay, so on your YouTube channel, is this like the most adventuresome thing you've done so far? So far, this is probably, it takes top adventure spot for sure. Yeah. This is great. And it's peaceful. I think someone that's afraid of heights could work their way up to this. It was the initial going up there, the unfamiliarity, I think. But once you're up here, it's pretty... Pretty spectacular, y'all. It is. I would have never just signed up for this. Really? Never. You don't like, what can I do for the weekend? And look up stuff online? No. No? Is that what you do? Sometimes, yeah. Like, hey, I have a free day. Let's see what trouble we can get into. And sometimes you end up a couple hundred feet in the air. I'm so glad you made me do Thank this. Thank you. I'm so glad you joined me in our giant kite. I sure. <laughs> Here we are. And Paul, you, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! And pro tips. Any pro tips for the people out there, what they should bring or how they should prepare for their Biloxi parasail? Well, I would say shoes that are going to stay on your feet. Okay, good. If you're not planning on going barefoot. Dipping your toes in the water. Yeah. And you probably don't want to bring your phone up there. No. You still have yours, right? I do. Okay. Well, panic moment. Is it in there? It is. Okay. 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 <laughs> Do you get a lot of like really good like comments and stuff on your videos? <laughs> Sometimes, a lot of times people are like, thanks so much for the tip. I didn't know I needed to bring Ziploc bags to Ship Island. And I'm like, yeah, you never know if you need to, you know, find a shell and put a shell in there or keep your clothes dry or, or something. Um, and then people are like, oh yeah, I want to try that on my next trip down to Mississippi. And uh, that's really heartwarming. It's really special to me. All right. You are now my Gulf Coast gal, pal for real. Oh my real. gosh. Yay. I love that so much. Thank you so <laughs> much. Oh, this is kind of big. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that was so fun. We're going skydiving next, right, Jamie? <laughs> and top pro tip from, from your Gulf Coast gal pal. Nicole says if you really want a venture in your life, you have to be ready for it. Now, she suggests having basic fun necessities already packed in your car at all times. And this includes sunscreen, a beach chair, a hat, a towel, and a sand bucket. That's what she said. Now to learn more, you can check out her YouTube channel at Gulf Coast Gal.